Hey guys, so today I am back with a favorites video, and this is the favorites for the month of February. So, um, hopefully you guys all know what a favorites video is. It's when a beauty guru just talks about her favorite items for the previous month. So, now that it is March 1st, the previous month was February, and I'm just going to be talking about some things that I loved for the entire month. So the first item was also my January favorites, but I just felt like I needed to include it because I love it that much. And it is the NARS Laguna Bronzer. And this month I hit pan. So I'm kind of sad about that because I've only had it for two months. And I've already hit pan, which means I'm going to have to go buy a new one as soon as I'm done with that. Hopefully this will last me through the end of March and some of April. So I don't have to buy it like every three months. But that product is just amazing, and I use it every single day. Obviously, when you use it every single day for two months, you're going to hit pan. So that product is just so amazing. So I am continuing to love that, and I will continue to love that for probably the rest of my life. Okay, so the next thing is something that I've also been using daily, and it is my Got To Be Smooth Operator. And I talked about this in my collective haul. Um, a lot of these products you've actually seen before because I included them in my collective haul. But um, I have to mention this. This stuff is amazing. I don't know how I lived without it. It is just an amazing product. It makes your hair so soft, so silky, and shiny. And it's just amazing. Um, I use it every day when I wake up um, after I've done my makeup. So... This stuff is amazing, so I just love this stuff so much. And the great thing about this is it's only like 6 or $7 tops. It's not expensive at all, and it's amazing. So the next thing is very, very exciting. Actually, all of these products are very exciting, but this was like super exciting for me, and it is the Too Faced Natural Eye Palette, and I know I spent quite a bit of time talking about this in my collective haul, but that I was just so excited for it. And um, so these are the nine colors. Uh, the first three are matte. The second three are just kind of like shimmery. And then the last three are like glitter. And my favorite colors are Silk Teddy, which is that one. And then I really like Push Up. And those two together are amazing. Um, I like Nude Beach, but I feel like I get a lot of fallout with that. And then Honey Pot is also a really, really pretty color. And then Heaven is a great um, color for under your eyebrow. And I cannot say enough good things about this palette. So I'm bringing this with me to New York. I'm leaving on Saturday, so if there aren't a lot of videos up next week, I'm sorry, but I'm not at home, so it's hard for me to make videos especially because it's a school field trip, so I'm going to have roommates, and it's just going to be a huge hassle for me to try and film and edit with other people in the room. So I'm sorry about that. But back to what I was saying, I'm definitely bringing this with me. It's going to be my everyday makeup, and it has been for the past month. Every single day I've used this. No joke. I'm surprised I haven't hit pan on this. Okay, so the next thing is my one by one Volume Express Maybelline mascara. And it comes in this like pinkish tube. And then this is what the wand looks like just a really basic circular wand. Um, this is the waterproof, but it is a really, really great mascara. Um, every Maybelline mascara that I've ever tried has been good. I've never tried one that has let me down. So I just think Maybelline mascaras are overall great drugstore mascaras. So I definitely was not disappointed by this one at all. It's just great like the rest of them. So um, yeah, there's not a lot I can say about it. You know, it does everything that I like. It makes my lashes black. It volumizes, lengthens. Everything that you would want in a mascara, it does. So I am really liking that. Okay, and then the next thing is the Garnier Skin Renew Anti-Dark Circle Roller. And this is the tinted one. And so you just kind of like rub it on your skin and then you blend it. 
And I think it will pretty much blend into any skin tone. Um, I don't know, but it works for my skin tone. And um, this product is just so great. I have only been using it for a couple days, like I said, in my collective haul. So I can't really tell you about the anti-dark circle thing. But I can definitely tell you that the caffeine in it works amazingly. And it just feels refreshing. And every morning I just look forward to putting it on because I feel great when I do. So it wakes me up. It makes me feel refreshed. And it's just an overall great product. So um, I've really, really been liking that. Okay, so the next thing is actually a body splash. And this is my Victoria Pink Body Splash. And it's the purple one, which is sweet and flirty. So, yeah, this stuff is just a great scent. It's not heavy or anything because it's a body splash, obviously. But it is just a really nice, sweet scent, like it says. So I'm all up for that. And it smells really, really good. So, um... I'm loving this. This is like the mini version. So I think this was like $10 and then there's a full size, but I didn't get that. Okay, the next thing is a Dazzle Glass and this is Baby Sparks. I would show you the letters on the back, but it's in gold because I got it with the Tartan collection. So you're not going to be able to see it at all. But it's like this sparkly baby pink like the name suggests. And you can already see that I've used a bunch of it. Um... If you didn't know, Dazzle Glasses have the brush applicator, not the doe foot. Um, I am not really sure which one I like better. I kind of don't have a preference. I like them both. But this is, like, such a pretty color. I'm really into Dazzle Glasses right now, so I'm going to have to pick up some more Dazzle Glasses. <sighs> okay, so the next thing is a MAC Lip Gloss, and I've been using this so much like the name is coming off you can't even see where it says lip gloss because I've been using it so much and this is blessedly rich so hopefully you can see that it says blessedly rich um I know I've mentioned this a couple times and it is honestly the prettiest lip gloss I've ever seen in my life I love this stuff I wear it all the time I mean, obviously, you guys aren't going to be able to tell unless you're seeing it in person. So, oh my gosh, I just love that lip gloss so much. It's honestly my favorite lip gloss ever. And I'm really sorry, but you can't get it anymore because <clears throat> this was with the Tartan collection. But if you go to a CCO, you definitely need to look for it because it is so pretty and I love it. <clears throat> Okay, so the next two things are both eyeliners. Um, this is the Urban Decay 24-7 Glide-On Pencil. And it's just in zero, just your basic black. But I got this with one of my um, Urban Decay palettes. And I just never used it because I was like, I have enough black eyeliners. You know, I don't really need to use it. I mean, I used it before, but I never used it to such an extent and I recently started using it on my upper lash line for, like, school. And this stuff is amazing. I mean, I don't understand why I never really got into it before. Because this stuff is so great. That's what the top looks like. Just a black, you know. But. But, I mean, it's so pigmented. I don't understand why I never really, really got into it. So for February, I got into it, and I love this stuff so much now. It's amazing. The last thing is the Physician's Formula Gel Eyeliner for Hazel Eyes. So comes with, oops, can you guys see? So it comes with a brown, a purple, and a black. And you can separate all of them into, like, individual gel eyeliners if you're traveling and you only want to take one. Um, but I really, really like the black on the bottom. Okay, so last time I showed you it, and I don't think you could see the purple sparkles, but I can see it on my camera, so hopefully you guys can see it, because I have some natural sunlight showing through this time. 
So that black on the bottom is amazing and I love it. And it's so great that it comes with so many colors because like this purple is really, really bright. Like this stuff is no joke. So for me, that didn't really seem like a lot of favorites, but this is stuff I've been using every day. So I don't know. So I hope you enjoyed all of my February favorites. I promise to have some March favorites that you guys haven't already seen and that I'm not repeating myself on. But um, when I go to New York, maybe I'll go to the Mac store and buy some new products because they have some cool collections that came out and I really want to check them out. So maybe I'll go do that. That sounds like fun. And then I can tell you guys about it. Or I can wait and tell you guys in March favorites. I don't know yet. So I'm going to go. I hope you guys enjoyed my video. And I will see you in the next video. Bye, guys.